How's it going everybody? Welcome, welcome to the channel. This is your boy Mars. Today got the Camaro, man. I really thought I was going to tune, uh, that I already tuned this Camaro, but I didn't. This is the 17ZL1 Camaro. Uh, this one, the original engine, supercharged, gives you almost a thousand horsepower. And I, I am going to show you guys the other engine as well that gives you 1,500 horsepower. It's an 8.9 liter V8. Uh, so like always, everybody new to the channel, man, hit that subscribe button. And let's get right to it. Let's go right over here to the upgrades, custom upgrades. As you guys are going to see, the car has, there you go. It's going to be 997 horsepower with a torque of 874, weighs 2,800 pounds. Uh, then you got this couple other engine swaps, but we're going to also do this one as well. Uh, so let's do the original engine, leave it rear wheel drive as you guys see, and then let's go over here to the build. We're just going to simply put everything on here, uh, race. So we're just going to slap on all these parts. Um, so yeah, car is supercharged. I think I had, I don't know if, how many supercharged cars I've ever done, but this one is officially supercharged with the original engine on it. Supercharged gets you that instant torque, man, off the line, so you got to kind of watch out with that uh, wheel spin there. Uh, but besides that, Supercharge is pretty cool. Sounds real nice. It's real cool for like roll racing and stuff like that with Supercharge. Um, but I mean, it is what it is. People, you know, like it, so people don't. Um, but yeah, make sure to put all these parts you guys see. As you guys saw, um, I have Rally on the suspension. Rally, that soft suspension is really good to squat in on the back there. Um, and then, really, really neat one of the things everybody keep requesting is four speed transmissions. So I got the four speed on there. Uh, this is a quarter mile car, so hope you guys like it for the quarter mile. Nothing to, uh, not, nothing else on there. And let's go over here. Make sure to put all those parts like you guys saw. Race uh, drag on the tires. No width on the front. Full width on the rear. And then there's any 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 wheels you guys like that are light. Um, and I got 20s in the front and 20s and uh, yeah, 20s in the front and 20. Okay, yeah. I was gonna say I thought I was going crazy. The wheels, yeah, these so I got these West Force on there, super lightweight wheels. They're all blacked out, make it look real cool. Um, when it comes to this, nothing with the bumper. I did took off the spoiler there to reduce some weight. Uh, this is actually you can make this a cop car, so if you want to put the lights on top. Uh, but I got this hood on there to reduce some more weight as well. As you guys see, the hood reduces that weight, or you can put this one. Uh, but I like this one better. And uh, that is it. Got this uh, this highlighter green color. <laughs> Um, and let's so let's back out here. Let's go right to the tune, guys. Uh, 1.90 to 64.0 to 100 traps 169 because it's only a four-speed transmission. Uh, 40 in the front, 15 in the rear, and then here we go. It's three on that final drive. 420, very short first gear. Uh, second gear is 220. Uh, third gear is 160, and then 120. Then we have here at two and then uh, a little bit positive in the rear so when it squats down that evens out there uh the positive in the two in the front is so that uh, reduces some drag there with that front tire all the way on the floor there besides that everything else is seven and uh seven here in the end and everything else is zero uh this is kind of like people do it so people don't do it it's just up to you guys just to put it at zero or not it's up to you guys uh, besides that 65 65 soft in the front stiff in the rear at 440 and then the vehicle race all the way up. Then I got nice little equal distribution at 115.51. Nothing with this or this. And 100 in 100. So that is it. Let's bring it outside right to the quarter mile. Hope it's not raining. I think it is. If it is, we're just going to hold it off. Alright, it looks like it's about to rain. Um, but yeah, let's take it out for a little spin real quick. Perfect. Let's go and take it to the quarter mile. Show you guys where the quarter mile is at. Um, I also made a uh, share code there for the quarter mile strip. If you guys want to use the actual event and it's a quarter mile instead of the half a mile, uh, you guys can use it. It's a little bit longer, um, but it's, it, I almost got it. I almost got it. So this event right here, this fast festival drag event, if you guys want to do that event, I have it that there's a quarter mile. I am going to show you guys that as well. 
Um, but yeah, make sure to get the tires hot. But the quarter mile initially is right over here. 440 yards is a quarter mile. Um, so yeah, if you guys did not know that, 440 yards, it is a quarter mile. Let's go right over here. And as you guys see, if I go towards the pictures here, we should be pretty close. Yep, they're, they're up. There you go. 440 yards, it's right over here next to this pole there. All you gotta do is let go. Look at that, back in squats down like that. Supercharger kicked in full force. And you're gonna trap 163. 163, make sure to get those tires hot though so you can grip even more on it. Um, but yeah, look at that, super nice. Super, 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 super nice. Let's see what this thing is doing. 900, almost a thousand. Let's call it a thousand horsepower. Let's go to the festival event. Let me show you guys my little festival event that I did here for you guys. Hope you guys like it too. It's, it's not that bad. Not that bad. Um, as you guys see, I'm going to press down here. And there goes the code for it. I have two of them, but there goes the code for this one. The other one's a little bit longer. This one is like 449 yards. Um, let's get right inside of it. Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. You can use any cars on here so you can kind of find out what your cars are running in the quarter mile. Um, you can also specifically tune your cars for the quarter mile to kind of have an idea of uh, like where you're at. Um, so kind of put these props on here, kind of make it a little bit realistic on it. Uh, but I just wanted it to be wide enough so that you guys can uh, have some fun on here and get some real nice times. Oh, that is shit. Sheesh. Horrible knee. I'm hearing the engine, but I'm like, is it, is it redlining? Boom. There we go. There we go. This one does a 9.2. 9 9.2. 1,000 horsepower. Nine twos in the quarter mile. That's That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Nine twos in the quarter mile. Got the seats inside. You know, I already know this thing got you know stock handle. Uh, what, what the guy said, stock door handles. <laughs> oh man, that TikTok is hilarious. Alrighty, let's. Uh... There we go. I just shifted it from first to second real quickly. But yeah, nice, simple, man. Nothing too crazy on it. There we go. Let's see what we did now. There we go, same thing, nine twos, nine twos there with a thousand horsepower, supercharged, uh, fully, fully loaded on this. Um, it's cool, 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 cool. So yeah, man, I hope you guys like it. I hope you guys like it. Let's go and show you guys that 1500 horsepower and that will sum up the video, man. Super, super cool. Let's see what this weather's looking like. Uh, this looks like it's coming, looks like it's coming. Let's go over here, boom. And then I'm gonna show you guys the other one so i have a, a whole specific other one which is like i like for now on i'm gonna just make two separate cars of, of you know so i got this one here both of the paint jobs i got from the storefront so if you guys search them up you can you know find this one too with the uh, the panther on the side there looking cool and uh let's go right over here as you guys see 1500 horsepower automatically you get this 1500 horsepower with 11 foot pounds of torque um, besides that, the suspension is exactly the same. Um, so I don't want to really get into depth with all the suspension and all the other stuff. Um, the only thing that's different is the transmission is not going to have that 4 p transmission on there. It's going to have this there. And uh, that's it. Yeah, that's it. No 4 speed transmission. Everything else is just going to be race. Uh, same exact tires. Make sure to put those right, the right drag tires and not put the semi slicks. Do not put those. Uh, and in the width and in the hood and all that is exactly the same. Let me show you guys the tune. The tune is a little bit quicker now. We got uh, 40 tire pressure in the front, 15 in the rear. 1.70 to 60. 3.40 to 100 traps, uh, 272. Uh, there goes the final drive, 220. First gear is 350, 240, 185, 145, and 115. Fifth gear. Zero everything out in seven. Uh, 65, 65. Uh, all the way slammed on here on the springs all the way to soft and then the car raced all the way to the to the top And then equal distribution at 113.31 Nothing with this or this and a hundred and a hundred. So let's uh Bring it outside real quick and then show you do a couple passes. Hope it's not raining if it is raining I'm still do the pass because I'm not gonna be waiting for that weather to change. That thing takes forever Alrighty, so here we go Let's go to the half a mile. This is mainly more for a half a mile if you guys want to put the, the four-speed transmission, you guys can put it as well. Um, these gears are very long, so it, uh, it should help out as well. 
Make sure to get the tires hot. Always, always, always get them hot. E-brake gas. Now we got 11, 11 foot-pounds of 1100 foot-pounds of torque, 22 pounds of boost. If it does spin, let go of the gas and then shift it. If not, uh, just stick on to the gas. Um, if you get, if, you, if yours keeps spinning on you, make sure to be standard on simulation. Uh, so let me show you guys my settings really quick. Make sure to be standard on the steering here and not simulation. Please do not be on simulation. And manual with clutch, it is the best way of doing it. Manual with clutch. Uh, but yeah, this car always needs to get those tires a little bit hot. If it does keep spinning on you, just go towards speed. About like 10 clicks. But as you guys see, look how it hooks. It hooks very, very smooth. Um, and it just, it just moves really good. 200. It traps like 208 on the half a mile there so man, you can't go wrong with that guys you can't 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 go wrong with it but yeah hope you guys like the video subscribe enjoy and i'll see all you guys around with another traction video peace out everybody bye bye now